Hey guys, so um, right now I don't have any makeup on or anything. This is because I am going to be testing the Smashbox X-rated mascara versus the Too Faced Better Than Sex mascara. Now I currently use this one and I love it. I think it's a really good mascara and this one from Smashbox has gotten some pretty good reviews. So I'm just going to put them to the test right now. I don't have any mascara on whatsoever. So I will be showing you guys one by one. I'll have the Smashbox one on this side and the Too Faced on this side. So let's get started with it. Okay, so for starters, this one is definitely giving me a lot of length and volume. Um, I do like this. It looks pretty nice. So let's see how it compares to the Too Faced Mascara. Okay, so I do have both of them on right now. So far, I really do think the better than sex is better. Technically, it's in the name. But, as you can see, this side is very natural, and this side is very intense. Let's see? My lashes are very full and long. Here, I do have some length, but it's not really, you know, the to the strength that I'd like. I like this one because it's not like you have to wear falsies with it or anything else. Um, the Smashbox one, yes my mirror is shaped like a cat. <laughs> it's very, like I said, natural looking, that's what it is. but maybe if you're a type of person who goes for a more natural look, if you're the type of person who goes for a more natural look, I would suggest getting the Smashbox mascara. I did pick this one in an ipsy bag, so I thought this would be a decent idea to compare them because I do use the better than sex. Because I do use the better than sex one a lot, but overall I really do think this is really worth all the hype that it has. So with that, I am going to end this video by saying the better than sex one. So I just did a quick um, coat of each one off camera and at least with the x-rated one it really didn't make a difference. Now you can see it is very voluminous and still has that length. Compared to the better than sex one, this one I don't think builds up as nicely as this one did. This one went from a very natural look that you can wear whatever if you're that kind of person to, okay, now we have something going. Um, this one, like, first coat, it makes you look total fake lash. Now, the problem with this one is it does get kind of clumpy as you build it up. That was really my only complaint with it. This one, same problem, but not as much. So I'll leave it at that, and you can make your scissors for that. So that's the end of this video. If you like this video, make sure to subscribe to my channel. I am hopefully coming up with more videos. Not daily, but you know, I will have a lot weekly. So that is it for now. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!